Multiple sclerosis is a multifactorial neurodegenerative disease of the central nervous system that affects populations all over the world. Although MS is autoimmune in origin, what elicits the onset of this devastating disease is still unspecified. It is becoming apparent through research that certain individuals are more genetically susceptible to the activation of the autoimmune response through the combination of genetic, environmental and epigenetic effects. Multiple sclerosis affects the CNS through the demyelination of axons as well as axonal degradation. The attack on the CNS leads to diverse symptoms experienced by sufferers such as gait, loss of nerve sensation and dexterity, cognitive impairment, optic neuritis, fatigue and many other symptoms. There are four main categories of multiple sclerosis, those being relapsing remitting, affecting 80% of sufferers, secondary progressive, affecting 10 to 20%, and the less common primary progressive and progressive relapsing type. Research has shown strong evidence to suggest that there is a genetic link, as well as epigenetic and environmental factors that contribute to the onset of MS. The human leukocyte antigen classes of peptides are inherited from maternal and paternal lineage and are highly polymorphic. HLA proteins form part of the major histocompatibility complex and are separated into two classes. HLA class 1 consists of HLA-A, HLA-B and HLA-C and class 2 comprises HLA-DP, HLA-DQ and HLA-DR, those constituting the six haplotypes. HLA-DRB1 is a heterodimer containing an alpha and beta chain comprising part of the MHC class 2 molecule that exists on antigen presenting cells of the immune system. The MHC2 molecule of APC presents as a portion of protein from phagocytized antigen to CD4 T helper cells to initiate a cell mediated immune response. A polymorphism of the HLA DRB1 gene, specifically the HLA DRB1 1501 allele, is identified as the major genetic predisposition linked to the development of MS. The HLA DRB1 1501 segment on the short arm of chromosome 6 has demonstrated to be significantly involved in benign and malignant MS patients. The dysfunction of the immune system caused by the HLA DRB1 polymorphism is what causes the autoreactive response seen in MS sufferers. The axons of the CNS are highly insulated by oligodendrocytes which produce the myelin sheath wrapping the CNS axons, improving saltatory conduction of the neural impulses. Microglia, the resident phagocyte of the CNS, and macrophages patrol for antigens along with antigen presenting cells. The DRB1501 variation of the MHC class 2 causes it to recognize the myelin binding protein found on the myelin sheath triggering a cascade events. APC can be seen presenting a portion of the MBP to the T17 cell, thus activating it to release cytokines. The release of these cytokines causes maturation of the naive B cell to a plasma cell and the formation of antibodies against the myelin sheath. The formation of the antibodies, which are then secreted by the plasma cell along with the cytokines, activates the macrophages and the microglia to begin destroying the myelin sheath and in the process damaging the axon causing a, a sclerotic plaque. This leads to the secondary axonal degeneration leaving sufferers with permanent disability through the complete loss of that neuronal impulse. Future research should combine genetics, epigenetics, environmental factors and pharmacogenomics to unravel the cause of this insidious disease, with the expectation of also finding a cure and proposing more effective treatment options so the millions of sufferers worldwide can reclaim the quality of life they once possessed prior to diagnosis.